What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Pisces, and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up and be notified for future readings. This free channel collective reading for Sun of Pisces. This is an AP of Pisces in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or they may have your chart. Stuff get the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free channel collective reading. Love you guys so much. Um, thanks for all the love and support to the channel. Thanks for all my new subscribers. You guys are just the bestest. Um, okay, so this first on of Pisces is to resonate if you have Pisces in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Name, and Jupiter charts. Um, and only take the message or messages that resonate because this is a free general collective reading, not a personal, okay? Spirit messages you have on Pisces. I received one channel message as I was meditating on your energy, Pisces. I heard stolen money is about to have to be returned soon. So energies can be reversed, so only you know if you have stolen money or not. If it's not you, it's somebody you're connected to. But some kind of stolen money is about to have to be returned soon. Um, whoever this applies for, whether it's a Pisces or somebody connected to a Pisces, okay? It's coming up in your energy. All right, we have skull, hidden secrets that can harm you. I think that's the stolen money for either a Pisces or somebody connected to a Pisces. Table, hard work ahead, happiness. Share with the dish you have with us. Scorpion, spare message to share with us. A call from a lawyer is about to become very significant in a Pisces life. A call from a lawyer is about to become very significant in a Pisces life. So some kind of call from a lawyer. Um, I feel for a lot of you guys, you're about to receive the call from a lawyer or somebody you're connected to. Well, I heard it's significant in Pisces life. So yeah, I think you're about to receive the call from the lawyer, Pisces. Maybe for some it might make you happy or it might reveal some kind of hidden secrets, how that resonates and applies um, in one's life, Pisces. For some, I feel you'd be dealing with the water sign. Uh, we have double water sign energy, um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. If you are, they have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, and Jupiter charts. If you are, for some, it might be a um, water sign lawyer or you're dealing with with a water sign and that's why you're about to receive a call from a lawyer how that resonates and applies okay but somehow this call from the lawyer is um about to become significant The past is about to come up in a huge way. The past is about to come up in a huge way. So you plug it in how it resonates. The past is about to come up in a huge way. So to me, that can go positive or negative. You have to plug it in your own life how it resonates. The past is about to come up in a huge way. For some, the past coming up can make you happy. For some, it can reveal secrets. Uh, how that resonates and applies. You have double happiness, um, Pisces. Scorpion.
Someone is about to betray you in a huge way. For some, it's a family member. For some, it's a community member. For some, it's a co-worker. For some, you know this person is a snake. For some, you don't see it coming and you're about to realize it. Okay, someone's about to betray you in a huge way. Um, whether it's a community member, a co-worker, or a family member, you don't see it coming. For some, for some, you do. For some, you know they're a snake. For some, um, you don't know they are. So, uh, I'm about to get um, psh, 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 hit with a scorpion stinger. Whether it's a family member, a community member, or a uh, uh, or a uh, confirmation. You might get a phone call, or a text, or email, or message, or something. But, um uh, yeah, uh, about to get hit with a scorpion singer, whether it's uh, a family member, a community member, or a co-worker. Oh, man. For one, you're about to realize you have been sex trafficked. For one, your children have been sex trafficked. For one, you're about to reveal information on someone else being sex trafficked and their children being sex trafficked. Okay, so for one of you guys, you're about to information the secrets here or information that you have been sex trafficked and your child or children have been sex trafficked. Secrets coming out. I think it's going to make you happy. For some, you are about to be the one to reveal information on someone else, either their children being sex trafficked or you being sex trafficked. How that resonates and applies, and that could be the scorpion stinger energy too. Um, somebody sex trafficking somebody. Whether you were the one that was sex trafficked or you're delivering information on somebody else being sex trafficked. How that resonates and applies. Frog. A stolen inheritance is about to be returned through many series of chain of events. For one, you're about to help it be returned. For one, you have it. Okay, I heard a stolen inheritance is about to be returned through many series of chain of events. For one, you have the stolen inheritance. And for one, you're about to help it be returned. So, um, I think the rain is about to rain down on somebody. Hopefully their ass goes to prison for stealing an inheritance. And I'm just being for real. That is the lowest of the low of the low of the low. That's shit on a shoe energy. Um, so, but one, you're going to help return it. I think they're going to be crying, tears, uh, victim mentality, but they stole a freaking inheritance. I mean, they should be held accountable for their actions. But for one, you stole it. So I think you're going to um, be crying. But... The thing is, is you shouldn't have stole a stolen inheritance. If you're the thief that stole a stolen inheritance, Pisces, just saying, just saying. Someone's about to be apprehended very soon. Someone's about to be apprehended very soon. Someone's about to be apprehended very soon. So um, whoever that is, apprehension. So uh, I don't know if this is by a bounty hunter or a um, private eye or a police officer or a detective or what have you, what have you. Somebody's about to be apprehended, whether it's a Pisces or somebody else. Skull, hidden secrets can harm you. A Taurus is about to become very significant in Pisces' life, some in a positive way, some in a negative way. Okay, Tauran energy. Um, a Taurus is about to become very significant in Pisces' life, either in a positive way or a negative way. We have the happiness energy uh, for some. They can make you happy in a positive way. For some, um, the negative way could be secrets. You plug it in, how it resonates. You do have double happiness energy in here. Whoever this Taurus is to you. Skull, hidden secrets can harm you.
For one, you're a secret drug user and you're about to be revealed, exposed through many series of chain events. For one, you lied and said somebody else was a drug user in the past and they're not. And that's about to backfire on you in a huge way. Oh my God. Okay, so for one of you guys, um, you're a secret drug user and you're about to be exposed through many series of chain events. So the hidden secrets that can harm you is the drug use. Um, however that resonates and applies. But for one, um, you lied and said somebody else was a drug user in the past, but I heard they're not and you're about to be exposed through many series of chain events. Um, that's serious. You can't go around... That's like defamation of character for anybody who doesn't know that. That's defamation of character. You cannot go around lying and saying people are drug users and alcoholics and things that can defame their character and life livelihood uh, because that looks badly upon you when they aren't really that, if anybody needs to hear that. But for one, you are. You are a secret drug user, um, and you're about to be exposed to many series of chain events. I wonder if it's a drug screening at employment situation or a CPS asking of a drug screening through CPS. Now, of course, you can refuse the drug screening through CPS and lawyer up for anybody who doesn't know that. But, um, but I mean, how that, how are you about to be exposed to a drug user? I don't know for the one that's a drug user. Okay. Damn. Table, hard work ahead. An affiliation with the Libra feminine in the past is about to backfire on the Pisces in a huge way. An affiliation with the Libra Fem and a Sag Fem. An affiliation with the Libra Fem and a Sag Fem is about to backfire on the Pisces in a huge way. So a lot of past energy, um, whoever this is for, you are affiliated with a Libra feminine and a Pisces Fem. I'm, I'm not a Pisces Fem, a Libra Fem and a Sag fam in the past, but I heard that's about to backfire on you in a huge way. So hidden secrets can harm you is the affiliation with this dark, low vibrational Sag fam or uh, Libra fam of your past. Um, it's about to come out in a huge way. You don't want it to. Okay, I heard it's about to come out in a huge way and you don't want it to. So this affiliation with this Sag fam and this Libra fam that you don't want to come out is about to come out in a huge way. Whoever you are, Pisces. I wonder if it has to do with lying about saying somebody's a drug user. Um, possibly. I didn't hear it was. Table, hard work ahead. For one, you had it very, very, very cushy in your job, 3D workspace in the past, but you have realized now you have to work harder and you will have to work harder and you will have to continue to work harder. It's because of all the lies you told in the past. Someone needs to hear this. Okay, so for one, you had it very cushy, very lush and very cushy and very easy in your workspace, 3D workspace in the past, Pisces. You can be masculine or femme. Um, but it sounds like this energy has shifted and now you are you have to work harder in your work, your workspace. Um, and I heard you're going to have to continue to work harder, but it's because of all the lies you had told in the past. One of you guys has like diabetes, and I'm just being for real. Um, Yikes. But um, yeah, so hard work ahead is basically you having to work harder because I think your lies have been, ex they have been exposed or is about to be exposed. Uh, one of you guys got diabetes and I'm just being for real. And a move is about to become very significant, some to you, some to another person. And a move is about to become very significant, one to you, got, uh, one to you Pisces, so I feel you're about to move. Um, and for one, somebody else is about to move. So I feel this is like moving boxes, moving vehicle, a U-Haul, a moving company, what have you, what have you. Uh, whether you're about to move or somebody else is about to move. But a move is about to become very significant.
I feel um I feel the energy of like a moving company or a U-Haul or um a trailer on the back of a vehicle um moving a, um a home. Not literally moving a home, but moving the contents of a home. And a rose bush that's about to just die. Die in a front yard. Some your front yard. Some somebody else's front yard. It's about to dead as a doornail. It's about to become very significant in your life. Oh my God. A rose bush. Okay, so a rose bush. Um, whether it's in your is in front of your home or somebody else's home. Um, it's about to become very significant. Um, this rose bush, I heard dead as a doornail, so I think it's going to be like petrified. Um, a rose bush dying, but whether it's in your front of your home or somebody else's home, happiness. A Pisces is about to move out of a very toxic city very soon. It's about to make them very happy. A Pisces is about to move out of a very toxic city very soon. It's about to make them very happy. So when you're about to move out of a very toxic city, it's about to make you very happy. We have double happiness. And a Leo femme that has had her happiness stolen from her, she's about to regain it through many series of chain events. One, you're about to help her regain it. For one, you're going to be upset about this. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates and Leo femme energy in here. So, um, a Leo femme had her happiness stolen from her. Uh, for some of you guys, um, whoever this Leo femme is to you. For one, you're going to be happy for her. Um, you're going to help her get her happiness back. For one, um, you're going to be upset that she's getting her happiness back. Um, we, we don't do happiness haters over here. And that's just the truth. Um, if you commit, if you do the crime, you should do the time. And whoever this is, they have stole somebody's happiness. But I think it's because they have stolen something from somebody. They have definitely stolen something from somebody. A lot of things. They have definitely stolen something from somebody. A lot of things. So you plug in how it resonates. They have stole, stolen something from somebody, a lot of things. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Happiness hater. Um, but for one, you're going to help um, the Leo Femme get it back. That's wonderful. And for one, you're not. Um, you're going to be upset about it. Like happiness hater. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. And secrets are about to come out. About money that should have been given to a Leo Femme a long time ago. A very long time ago. A lot of it. For one, this is going to be very significant in your life. Okay. And for one of you guys, secrets are uh, heavy Leo Femme energy in here. So secrets are about to come out uh, about a Leo Femme that should have been given a lot of money a long time ago. Uh, some in her childhood, some in her adulthood. It was all stolen. Okay, I heard some in her childhood and some in her adulthood. It was all stolen. So, um, she should have had money that came to her in her childhood and her adulthood, but it was all stolen. Um, so basically, you know, when you steal somebody's money, one, that's a crime, and two, you're stealing somebody's happiness because you're taking away their financial freedom. Um, but for one of you guys, at least that's what becomes significant in your life that basically somebody has stolen a Leo feminine's money 
in her childhood and her adulthood. So they have, uh, I don't feel for a majority of you guys, it's you that stole her money. Um, but it's somehow the secrets coming out about her money being stolen in childhood and as an adult is about to become significant in your life. For some, it could make you happy that the secrets are about to come out. But you plug it in how it resonates, um, Pisces, okay? Happiness. Number seven could be very significant number of one's life. Number seven, happiness. A child is about to regain their happiness back. They have been suppressed. They're about to gain it back through many series of chain events. A child is about to gain their happiness back. They have been suppressed um, through many series of chain events. So happiness energy. Um, the child about to regain their happiness back. Well, that's wonderful because... Um, they should. They should. Every child should uh, be happy, and that's just the truth. Every child should be. Um, and they shouldn't have their happiness suppressed from them, and that's just the truth. An airy spirit that was once on a Libra side, Libra Fem side, is about to turn on them in a huge way. It's a veteran Aries masculine. He's about to start invading her dreamscape, invading her thoughts, invading everywhere. This is about to become very significant to one of you. It's about to start giving her serious mental health issues, serious. Uh, airy spirit, masculine, veteran. So um, he is passed over to the other realm. Um, he's an Aries spirit, veteran. Um, he once was on a Libra Femme side, but I heard he's not on her side anymore. I heard he's about to start invading her dreamscape and her thoughts and everywhere. Um, I, I guess mentally, uh, I heard he's about to start giving her severe mental health issues. Uh, maybe for some, it might make you happy. Whoever this Libra Femme is, um, her mental health is about to start declining in a huge way. She's a huge fraud. Okay, I heard her mental health is about to start declining in a huge way. She's a huge fraud. So, whoever she is, she's a huge ass fraud. Her mental health is about to start declining in a huge way. And a Sagittarius feminines. This Aries masculine is not messing around anymore. Okay, so not only is he about to invade the Libra Femmes energy, but the uh, Sag Femmes energy. And I uh, heard he's not messing around anymore. So, you plug it in how it resonates. I don't know. Um, their mental health are about to start declining in huge negative ways. Okay, I heard their mental health is about to start declining in huge negative ways. So we have a Libra Femme and a Sag Femme. Their mental health is about to start declining in huge negative ways. But it's because of an Aries masculine passed over veteran spirit. For one, you're about to go out. Much needed time out. No kids. It's going to be really good for you. Okay, for some, you're about to go out. Much needed time out. No kids. It's going to make you very happy and um, it's going to be very good for you. So, happiness. That's beautiful. Whoever you are, Pisces. Um, everybody needs a break away from kids. Um, whoever you are.
For many series of shame events, for one, you're about to and and uh, you're about to reveal some very important information that's going to put someone in prison. It's going to make you very happy. Through many series of chain events, for one, you're going to reveal some information that's going to put somebody in prison. It's going to make you very happy. So you know some deep information that could put somebody in prison, and I, uh, apparently you're about to reveal it, I think, with official reporting energy. And I heard it's about to make um, you happy to do it. So whoever you are, Pisces, it's some deep secret in, uh, energy here. Um, whoever you are, I feel you can be masculine or feminine. I heard it's going to be happy, make you happy to do it. Um, you're about to put somebody in prison um, because they're false. Yeah. Oh, my God. You cannot make this up. You cannot. False person, adjudication, imprisonment. They're false. They're asked about to go prison. Court date. I feel court date energy. I feel um, uh, legal fees because um, they're false. Wow. And But it's you revealing the information on um this situation i was trying to find the message card yeah message and for one you're about to take a gemini masculine to court child support and for one you're about to take a gemini masculine to court child support and one, you're about to take a Gemini masculine to court for child support. So um, this Gemini masculine was false in the past or something was false in the past. And you're about to take them to court for child support. How that resonates and applies. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. All right, I love you guys. Namaste.